and welcome back to my youtube channel today we're here in tiaroa and i'm gonna be doing one of the great one videos i guess we can say uh it's for every great one though not specifically red deer but i will be using red deer as an example today how to spawn yourself your very first great one let's hop right into it Now the first thing that you gotta do to spawn yourself your very first great one is find all of the drink zones for whatever species that you're grinding for. Now there are several different great one species now with the latest update fallow deer is the newest great one and that is also here in Tiawaroa. So you can grind for red deer, black bear, moose, whitetail, and fallow deer. Yes, there's five great ones now and it's... And it's insane how many great ones there are. I started playing when the white tail great one was the only one. Or maybe it was Red Deer. Let me know in the comments. I had, that was six years ago. I can't remember. And add this kill to the counter, which is 96 kills in. Um, yeah, so basically add the kills to the counter and th kill the males. Obviously, if you want to use herd management, watch my herd management guide uh, on Red Deer that I made yesterday or the day before yesterday. Um, it will be the same for every species except the levels will be different. You're going to want to shoot the mid-level animals, stack diamonds, and much, much more. All explained in that video. Now guys, when grinding, you are going to want to set up with tents and tripods at all of your favorite drink zones. I recommend at least drinks, 10 drink zones being harvested. I still have to set up right here. I found these two drink zones here yesterday. Um, basically what I do is I will put a tripod or a tree stand. There's a lot of trees right here. I'll put this tent here, walk to the tree stand, shoot this zone, use this outpost to claim this zone. That's basically kind of the rotation that we do here um, I will be placing another tent down here if this zone ends up not being a single stag zone as of right now there's only a level four in there so I'm probably gonna shoot it and wait for it to come back but uh, I'll, I would place the tent right here use that tent to claim this zone fast travel here and shoot this zone um, right here I literally just have this outpost I walk to here shoot or get in this tripod I can see the whole lake so I shoot every zone then I circle the lake and pick up all of my animals so this can save a lot of money and can save tents over here there used to be a zone right here which had a diamond in it it was a single stag zone unfortunately um, but I do have a tent and a tripod right here which I would harvest this zone with then I'd come over here and claim my kills right here I use this outpost to walk to here and then there used to be a zone right here. I'd shoot this zone, use this tent to claim that zone, and claim this zone, and I'd walk to here and claim this zone. So I will share a hotspot guide with you guys at the end of the video showing all the best places to find Red Deer Drink Zones here in Tiawaroa if you guys are doing the Red Deer Great One grind. Other than that, you're going to have to find your zones on your own, bro, unless I have made like a moose guide or something, which I have. Just go check out my channel. No guaranteed hotspot guides in every single map join my discord server all my amazing members will link uh, Hotspot maps that they themselves made or that they got from another youtuber uh, Shout out to pro XCK for letting us use some of his maps um, They're all in the discord server if you guys want to go check those out go into the discord server go to the call the wild drink times info The link is in the description no matter what you're grinding, there's always going to be single buck, single stag zones, and they get very, very annoying. So basically what you're going to want to do is take it out. I mean, this is only level 3, but just take it out, just like that. The zone will vanish, but it will come back in somewhere very, very soon. And basically, you just keep shooting that zone and hope that basically it'll come back with more than one deer in it. No matter what you're grinding, hopefully it'll come back with more than one deer. Right now so we're gonna drop him real quick and hope that he comes back as not a single stag zone that was not a very good shot he'll die though because i hit him when you're grinding as for inventory i highly recommend using the 300 magnum for every species in the great one world i guess we can say right now for all five species carry a weapon that is in class for your species for trophies and definitely pick a good weapon that's in class to use for your great one of your choice so basically use the 300 just to kill normally like I'm using right now. It'll take them down fast like the one over there. I didn't hit it good because I'm a trash PS4 player and my controller does not work. My controller works. It just sucks as playing on a controller. And um, basically just go through, shoot all your animals with the 300. Um, and once you spawn diamonds and you want to shoot them or rares and you want to shoot them, definitely use a weapon that's in class. And my friends, your best zones that you've been grinding to heck and shooting the mid-level animals that are not single crap zones, single stag zones, I like to call them single crap zones, don't make fun of me. 
they will start to look like this. Giant 8 Mythical, some big level 6s, and a pretty decent. Not too bad at all. The super thanks button down there by the like button by the dislike button don't click the dislike button that's just unfortunate um there is a spy super thanks thing down there you can donate up to like five hundred dollars is the max you can donate don't do it i don't need that much but um just like donate 99 cents or something it really helps support the youtube channel and motivates me to make more content just for you guys thank you guys so much and we'll see you guys in the next video as always play nice be nice i'm luke from the it's team and we'll see you later